In technology news, I brought two new pieces of technology into the home. I bought the third generation Philips Hue bulbs. So the reason I got these was uh, one, the third generation, they're supposed to be able to go dimmer and we want to dim the bedroom a lot more uh, at night for Daniel so that he's not waking up as easily. The other thing I bought it for was that the Philips Hue Hub, which I have, is only version one and the new application is no longer compatible with it, so I had to update. The other thing we brought into the home was the Bose earbuds. So these are wireless earbuds. Uh, they look really nice. They, they have tons of volume, which is what Stephanie was looking for. The only problem with these is that they charge via micro USB. If these charged with USB-C, I would love them a whole lot more, but hopefully these two pieces of technology are a solid upgrade to our home. I have two confessions to make. Number one, instead of focusing on productivity at home, I've been focusing on productivity at work. What this has meant is that I've been sleeping more, and then at work I've been really, really focused on achieving long-term objectives, which I think overall is the right call, but it's changed the blood, and it's changed the mix of productivity between work and home in a way that I haven't fully kind of internalized yet and figured out what does this mean for the vlog? How do I present this? How do I share this with the world? Because while at home, it's really easy to film projects, initiatives that I'm doing, it's not as easy to do at work. There's a lot of restrictions on what I can film. I have to be aware of confidentiality, all those sorts of things. And so I think that has been hampering the vlog a little bit. I've got a bunch of upcoming conferences, which I'm hoping to film and actually uh, at least give a flavor of, but I don't know how to capture work time productivity in these large major projects. So for example, one of the projects was that we just shipped the Angular Developer Survey 2019. So definitely go check that out. Uh, it's You can find it on angular.io. Any page you go to, you're gonna get a little banner at the top that says, fill out the one minute survey here. The other project that I've been working on instead of being kind of normal productive is a longer term project that I'm really excited about. I wore Google Glass for about three years of my life. And during that time, I took pictures and video basically every day. And what I wanna do is I wanna go through all of that footage and cut it together into around an eight minute video that samples those three years of my life. Everything from getting Google Glass on day one, experimenting with friends, to the places I traveled with it, all the way to my honeymoon in Paris where Google Glass finally broke. I think this is gonna be a really cool video project, uh, but it's harder than I expected. I thought, oh, I'll just find all the videos that were generated by Glass and then import them into the uh, editor and then cut them together, but even the file names changed over time and so even generating a list of just the Google Glass files has been challenging. Now I have a couple ideas of how to do this and I've gotten started on this project, but it is not ready yet. So I am making a commitment that I'm going to get this done over the next few weeks, but unfortunately it's not ready yet. And so today is going to be kind of boring. I'm sorry about that. Thank you for bearing with me. Thank you for watching. Talk to you soon.